and welcome back to my channel, Single Mom Review. If you would, stop for one second, look down below and click that subscribe board. I would love for you to join my channel. I'm jumping on today to do a Mask Monday. I know, I don't normally do these, but I jumped on today to do a Mask Monday because I'm doing a collab with Hope from Real Life with Hope. And we kind of reached out to each other and decided we wanted to do a little small collab with each other and thought, Mask Monday would be good, but we also, by being Team U is the new big thing that everybody's doing, we decided to also incorporate a Team U haul in with our Mask Monday. We are also both having giveaways, so you do have to be, be publicly subscribed to both of our channels to be eligible for either of our giveaways. And I'll tell you more about that at the end of this video, because you are gonna wanna know my secret word to be entered into that giveaway. Um, today I have, and I'm telling you, I'm already can tell that I'm going to have issues with this mask staying on above my lip with me talking, but it is the, from the Crim Shop Plump Up Skin, and this is the Animated French Bulldog Face Mask infused with rejuvenating, rejuvenating collagen. And I just thought it was adorable, but like I said, I am going to have all sorts of issues with this above my um, lip here it does not every time I talk it wants to move down on me so but it says bonjour there he's got some little ears he's got a little painter's cap on right here and a uh, little bulldog face so just cute as can be and um, I love crim shop masks and they are really 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 nice masks and I love all the fun things that they do but first of all, um, I do want you to make sure that you go down to my description box and click on the video that Hope, Real Life with Hope has, that's in the collab with me. Um, do go check her out. She is a sweet, sweet lady. She's doing all kinds of videos all the time. I don't know how she stays up on it, but she does. And I'm really enjoying getting to know her. And um, she has a little, has a daughter that's always on her videos with her too, just cute as a button. And they always have a good time. So I was super excited to get to do this collab with her, but do make sure you go down to my description box, click on that link and go over to her channel. So we both spent approximately $30 on our team U-Haul. It wasn't necessarily mandatory that amount, but I just we both just kind of tried to get some close to the same amount. But if you're one of my subscribers and watch very often, you all know that I am like, I don't know what the deal is with me and earrings right now, but that is exactly where I was drawn to in this in the Team U app. And Team U has so many items in there. I just kind of just thought, okay, I'm just gonna stay in this one section for this time and get my order put in to make sure that it got here in time for the Face Mask Monday collab because I didn't want to sit there and keep, there's thousands of items that you could just spend hours on. And so I thought, okay, I know I'm wanting some earrings. I knew kind of what I was looking for also. And so I thought, I'm just gonna stay in this department. I'm gonna make myself stay here, get some items, and that way I can get my order turned in and get them here in time for this and not have to be worried about it not making it. So, I did an earring haul from Team U. These are all earrings. You will be amazed at the amount of earrings that I got for $30. And it, mine was right at $30 like maybe 31, but it was very, very, very close to $30. And I was really um, amazed that I could get that many. I was, I actually had like 60 or $70 worth of earrings in my bag, <laughs> in my cart. And I had to go back and sort through and dwindle that down. Cause I could have went on for hours, which is ridiculous for me to do that. But anyways, they just had so, so many. So let's see what I have. So I just did a quick count because I couldn't quite remember and I hated to speak if I wasn't sure. I got 25 pairs of earrings for 30, it was thir between 30 and $31. That's crazy that I got that many earrings for that much money. Um, I am going to also down in my description box, I'm going to try to leave a link for each of the earrings that I got. So if there's something that you like, you can go down in my description box, click on that link and take you directly to that to that um, earring 
Also, I'm also going to leave a 30% off discount code down below and a link for you to go straight to Timu. Um, with that, if you want to go, if it's your first order, you can get 30% off. I would love for you to do that. But let's not wait any longer and let's see what kind of earrings I got. First of all, let's start with football. And the first set I got was these right here. Let's open these up. These are adorable. The quality of these, I'm honestly really amazed at. And I will put, try to put the prices that I paid for these. Look at these earrings. Are those not the cutest football earrings? I thought these are so cute. Oh my gosh, look at them. I, and the backs of them are wood. So these were um, just the football shape with the wood. I really like those. I will get so much wear out of these types of things. This is my next set. I really like these. These are super cute. And they're really, I've had some other ones like this that I bought other places, the same quality. But they say game day. And they front and back. I like that about them because sometimes I have one ear that wants to turn and this way it's on both sides. I love that. That they say game day. Are those not the cutest? Oh my gosh. And then these are black. They had all colors in these. So like whatever your school colors are you could get. They're more of almost like a they're kind of Flexible, but they're almost like a, a velvet. Um, but they're a little, they've got a little, I mean, they're a little thickness. But they're very lightweight. They, I got the black because we're black, orange, black, and white. So I just thought they were adorable. So, and there was, I probably had nine pairs of football earrings in my basket. I had to take some out. I could have went on for days. Next as season that we're in right now is basketball. Aren't those cute? I really, this kind of uh, little leather, like the game day ones were, I really like it. I really, I have other earrings that are that same material and they are really nice. Basketballs. I'm gonna, I, these earrings made my day. Here is another pair, and they, these are just like the football ones, but they're basketball. And they have all kinds of sports. They had softball, soccer, but these are the same wood like the others. These just have basketballs in the middle of them. So cute. And these basketballs. And I always kind of like, okay, I don't need two wood basketballs, but I liked the way that these were teardropped. The, the shape was, and not round. But they're the wood with the basketball in them. So cute. Well, then the next sport my son plays is baseball. I love, like I said, I love this material. These, um, this, uh, the game day and then the one basketballs and these. When I go back to order more, I'm really going to focus in on this material. I love this material. It has, it's leopard with baseball on it. I love those. So neat and so cute. That's kind of the material I'm talking about. I love that material. I can't think of a name for it. The next ones are these, and they are the wood, but they're hearts with the sport inside of it. I like that. I was going to try all these on, and then I was like, okay, that's going to take forever. 25 pair was going to be forever. Look at those. Are those not adorable? They did have these with basketball and football on them also. And I may be going back to get those. I don't know. I tried to limit myself to three of each sport because I had to set myself some kind of limit. All right, and then the other baseball ones. 
These are super cute. They remind me of Take Me Out to the Ball Game theme with the red white striped. And they are that same material as the game day. And, but they're three tier. I love these. Are those not the cutest things? Oh my gosh, I, these are adorable. This, if they would have had football and basketball on something similar that was the three tier shape like that, I probably would have got those. But these were the only ones I saw. And like I said, I was trying to go quickly but I'm really impressed with those for the amount of money. Okay, so then now the next thing I thought, okay, we're in Valentine's time. So I picked up some Valentine's earrings. I thought these were so cute. I had to limit, I mean, because they had St. Patrick's Day. Like I said, I had some Christmas in my cart that I had to take out because I was like, okay, you know, are those not the cutest? The three layer, three tier, cute, cute, cute for Valentine's. Then I got another Valentine's and these are the same. And these are like that wood teardrop shape that I got in the um, basketballs. These are so cute. And they had a million Valentine's earrings and I had to limit myself but I love the red the pink and the white with these with the wood I love these they had all kinds with leopard all kinds with hearts on them a million I could have went crazy in there too I did go ahead and pick up even though fourth of July was a little bit down the road I thought okay I didn't see any Easter ones Thank goodness, because I probably would have put those in my cart. So I did not make, get any of those, but I'm sure I'll be going back to get some. But I did see these for 4th of July, and they were the three-tier. So I loved that. I just thought they were adorable. And they're like a glitter. I thought they were just cute as could be. So I did go ahead and pick up a set of 4th of July ones. Even though I had told myself I was going to stay within the holiday, I did go out on a limb and get those. I just love the, the three-tier shape of those. All right, next I got some black. These are like a black crackle. Um, very, now these are more dressy. And I liked that. I wear black a lot. And so I thought these would be great to go with a lot of things and I thought they looked real, really nice. And I did, once I got them, I didn't notice it when I ordered them, but the black has is kind of a stone, like it has a, like some crackle lines in them. I mean, you can't feel it, it's not, it, that's the way the stone coloring is made to look, but I love that. I thought that made them even prettier. But I will get so much wear out of those, and these are nice. So in that same style, I also, I wear a lot of turquoise. I have a lot of turquoise jewelry. And so um, I thought, well, these would be a great little accent to my turquoise necklaces and so forth that I have. I thought they were beautiful. And they have that same crackling, but like that, these are gorgeous turquoise earrings. I love, I actually had about four or five pairs of turquoise earrings in my bag. I had to take some out. I went crazy on the turquoise too. Then I also picked up these. I just, I don't know why those kind of stood out to me. They, they just did. And um, this is probably the one pair that I got. And once I got them, I was like, oh, I wasn't as, I mean, they're fine. But I was like, oh, I probably should, could have picked something else that I would have maybe liked more. I think maybe it's because they're a little shorter. Um, but I, I still thought they were really, I think I, I picked these because I liked the silver and the gold metals. I love mixed metal. But the stone in the, in the middle, I wasn't just overly impressed with. But I think these will be cute still. I think they'll be cute. And they may even be cuter on. I haven't even tried them on. So I'm not, believe me, for the money, I'm fine with it. And then the other pair, like I said, I love this material that these and I love this brownish color. I wear a lot of tans and a lot of browns. 
And so these kind of stuck out to me too. And I just thought those were really pretty. And they are on the front and the back side. Like I said, I love that because that way if they turn, you still have the same design. But I thought those would go with a lot. And I like, love that material. And then I had, there was some, you can like get some that maybe have three in one, that you get three earrings with one in one package. And I was wanting some different fringy colors um, to wear with like when I specifically have something of one particular color on that I'm wanting to accent. And so I am a huge orange, you know, because our school colors are black, are orange, white, and black. And so, but these came in packs of three, which is fine. In the, in the summertime, I wear yellow, and then um, I also wear some hot pink. I do love hot pink. But I thought these were just super pretty. So I have my hot pink, I have the orange that I will get so much wear out of, and then I have the yellow. And I do have a couple of very pretty yellow shirts that I think those will really look nice with. If not, I'll gift them if I feel like I'm not gonna get much wear out of them, but I really wanted the orange. I really like that. And then I also, these are like a white, a red, and a black. I will get so much use out of all of these. I just really like fringy colors. I really like the tops of these. The color is very vibrant on those. I will be wearing those all the time. Then the last set that I got, and I think I got these because I love the navy. I wear a lot of navy too. And I don't really, I don't think I have a pair of navy earrings. And so I thought, okay, this would be perfect. And so there's the navy. Like that's pretty. These I do, these two, I don't know that I'll get a lot of wear out of. Um, I will gift them if I don't. Um, but I'm gonna go through my closet and see what I have to go with them first. Um, so that's my haul of 25 earrings <laughs> for 30, $31. I mean, you can't beat it. And I am going to have so much fun wearing those sports earrings. Oh my gosh, because it's like, you know, during basketball season, at least two games, if not three games a week. And during baseball season, it's three games at least, or four times a week. And then he plays competitive baseball and the oh, carries over through the month of July. So I'm gonna have just a ball wearing those earrings. So real quick, the giveaway. Hope and I both are having giveaways. My giveaway will be a mystery giveaway. Um, same rules as I always have, and they'll be down in the description box if you wanna go down there and check them out. But it's the same thing, you must be 18 years or older. I actually have changed the address part of my giveaways. If you, are, if you have a United States mailing address, you will get my mystery box of giveaways. If you, do, if you have something that is out of the United States address, if you're international, then I will be doing a gift card, a $15 gift card, and I will get with you to see what's near you that you would like to use a gift card to, whether it be Amazon or something like that. Um, but I wanted to start incorporating my international subscribers because I feel like that's only fair and I don't see um, postage going anywhere but continuing to go up. And so this way, I still can get you guys something, even though it's not the mystery box, um, I feel like it's still something for and to say thank you for watching my videos. Also, YouTube is in no way affiliated with this giveaway. My giveaway will end on February the 12th. Uh, on February the 12th, sometime that evening, I will go to the YouTube random comment picker. I will have, pick a winner, then I'll go to my community watch, then I will go to my community tab, post who the winner is. I'll come back to this video and I will pin a comment and then I'll also reply to the winner's comment so that you get a notification that I've replied to you. Um, I know that there's scammers out there, so if you do get a reply, all you have to do is come back to this video, scroll up to the top. If there's a pinned comment that says that you're the winner, then that's for me because I'm the only one that can pin a comment. I just do that to make it easier for you all to know whenever somebody may be scamming you or not. That way it's easy for you to find out. Huge shout out again to Hope for um, coming together with me and doing this little collab. Um, 
it's, it ended up, it gave me a reason to go shop at Timu. Yes, it gave me a reason to get all these wonderful earrings. So a huge shout out and thank you to Hope. Do make sure that you go down in my description box and click on that link and go check out her video and enter her giveaway. And if you're from my channel, tell her I sent you over there. And I will be talking to you all again real soon. Bye.